it's been like installing this new offense, kind of figure out where all the pieces fit so far? Uh, it's been fun. Uh, you know, trying to figure figure it out, get used to uh, what guys like to do within the offense. So I think that's the most challenging part. But everybody's having fun, with it, and I think uh, we'll keep progressing as we keep working. What, what, are, you doing? what are some of the things you guys are trying to do different offensively this year that you've been able to tell? Uh, just keep the ball moving. Uh, try not to get too stagnant and uh, putting pressure on the rim. You know, at the end of last season, it seemed like maybe you shot more threes. Is that something that you want to do more of, even with Trey out now? Is that something you feel a responsibility that y'all have to generate more threes, and if they come from you, that's okay? Or is that something you say, that's not really my role? Um, I mean, I wouldn't say it's not my role, and I wouldn't say I'm putting the pressure on myself to shoot more threes because Trey's out. Uh, we just kind of take what the defense gives us, and uh, we're okay with you know, whoever shooting open shots. Hey, considering I think last year you guys, your original starting line spent only 113 minutes together, how's that chemistry? Do you feel like it's coming along? Does it need to take steps forward? Are you guys already that familiar with each other that that's not a problem? Yeah, I mean, I think we just got to, especially with the new offense, just get familiar with what guys want to do within the offense. I mean, like I said, I think that our comfort will grow uh, more you know, as we continue to work and figure out the offense. There was some talk in media day about maybe putting the ball in your hands a little more and like some of those delay actions or some elbow series. Is that something you, you're, you're seeing a little bit being put into play here uh, in the first couple of days of training camp? Yeah, I mean, we did it, a, you know, we did it a, a lot. I think my uh, my first year and my second year, we did it, you know, sometimes. But I, I'm not com uncomfortable at all, uh, you know, playing small ball five. Um, I'm just... You know, here to do whatever they need me to do. How do you think it changes the, the dynamic when you are see us playing at the five? Um, I think it's, it, it makes it tougher on the defense. You know, this essentially the five guards out there, it's, it's tough to guard five guards. They can put pressure on the rim and shoot. You know? and during, the, during the second half of the year, we saw B.I. kind of make a jump with his passes too. What did you see with him just being able to create offense, you know, with the ball in his hands? Uh, I mean, my, when I first, my first time playing against B.I., that was the thing that stood out to me most is his passing. Um, I think he kind of put it on display a little bit more uh, when, like when, whenever you noticed it. Uh, but, I mean, that was always, I think, a strength of his is being able to, to play make. What, what makes him a good playmaker? Uh, his vision. I mean, and he loves the game. He studies the game. He, he knows where everybody's going to be. He tries to put guys in spots where they're comfortable. You guys were able to do some five-on-five five last night. Anyone in particular stand out to you in, in those runs? I mean, everybody played, you know, really, really good. It was, it was super competitive. I wouldn't say just one guy stood out, but the team in general, we, we competed uh, really, really good. You, uh, I mean this kind of lightheartedly, because the NBA has changed and evolved with switching and mobility and things like that. Do you even kind of chuckle sometimes when they say, like, small ball five? I mean, do you look at yourself and say, center? I mean, whatever, you can put whatever label uh, you need to, as long as... You know, I'm out on the court. I'm out there to do whatever the coaches and my teammates need me to do. I feel like to some extent you're used to that from college. That you played, you played some center in college, some right in college. Yeah, so, somewhat. I mean, I guarded some some centers, um, but I wouldn't just say I played center. Uh, I would I would just say I was out there on the court and I was kind of the, the dude that had to guard the centers. And then on the offensive end, it was kind of interchangeable in all five spots. One thing. This is your problem. Uh, year three for you. Uh, how's your confidence? How have you grown since your first time here and now today? Um, I think I've got a lot better uh, with, with keeping up with my routine. I kind of figured some things out, you know, when when to turn up my, my workouts, uh, when to kind of slow down on my workouts, just taking care of my body and, and being very, very, uh, being very uh, aware of, of what I'm putting into my body. One thing Willie talked about yesterday is in those small ball units, it's going to be super important for everybody to rebound. Uh, is that something they've talked to you about specifically or like the team, and, and, and how are you guys approaching that mentality? Yeah, they, they've talked to the team about it. I mean, I think the team knows. Like a couple games last year, we would have rebounded the ball well. We probably would have won more games. So I think that was the point of emphasis coming into the year is just, you know, being able to, to rebound. You know you're a big team guy, but is there any part of you that says, I want to shoot for, you know, all defensive team, defensive player, you know, those type of individual athletes this year? No, I don't really set those type of goals. Uh, I kind of let, let that take care of itself as long as the team's getting stops, I'm, I'm cool. I don't really get into the accolades. Do you pay attention when people 
praise you and say that you got snubbed when you're not on those teams? I mean, obviously, a lot of your teammates rally around you when they feel like you're not recognized for what you do. I mean, I let, I let those guys kind of do that. Uh, like I said, I don't really get into it. I just try to go out every night and make it tough on the guy that's in front of me.